merch box opening, you'll know that I'm super excited. God, I sound lame. All right, I'm not even gonna front with you. Hey, curlies, what's up? This isn't a hair video. It's not really a makeup video. It's kind of a beauty review. I'm reviewing the Liz Earl uh, Cleanse and Polish Hot Cloth Cleanser. I didn't realize I was supposed to use that. Reading is good. Anyway, <laughs> yeah, so I'm gonna try this because I'm really excited about it. This is actually part of my birch box for September. So if you watched that video, you know about it. If not, let me tell you about it. What really excited me about this particular cleanser was the fact that apparently you're supposed to use a hot cloth and they sent you one. They sent you like a muslin, muslin? I don't know. They sent you a cloth, a cotton cloth to use. And uh, it's a little bit different because it came with an instruction packet and everything, which is cool as shit because the usual two or three, like maybe one sentence instructions are not really the best for me. I like a lot of information. So Liz and Earl, it says to massage the cleanser onto your dry skin. So I'm going to give it a shot right now. Mm-hmm. It smells interesting. It has coconut butter, rosemary, chamomile, and eucalyptus. So I like this. It says over eyes, so I'm gonna use this over my eyes. I won't be able to see you guys, so I might look weird. This honestly feels amazing. Like it feels more like a cleanser. I mean, not a cleanser, a moisturizer than a cleanser. Like it feels, it's very creamy and smooth and it's not lathery. I love the, the lather in the shower, but this is really nice, you know? Oh my gosh, it has the consistency of a mask. I honestly, I'm in love with the consistency, but we'll see how it makes my skin feel. So I got my hot cotton cloth here. And it says to just gently massage your face and, you know, wipe it off. And it does say in the little instruction booklet to use a different part of the cloth every time, you know, you wipe your face so that you're not just rubbing it in and smearing it. Which is, I guess, why they gave me such a big cloth, which I'm going to save this cloth. I'm going to wash this. I love it. And it feels nice. Like, even the cloth itself is... It's not very rough or anything, but there's like a slight exfoliation effect going on. I should have opened my eyes a long time ago. Whoa, my face was dirty. <laughs> That's embarrassing, <laughs> Jesus. And I washed my face before I went to sleep last night. Like, I barely been anywhere, Jesus. Oh my God, there's more. Can you guys see that? My face is dirty. And I know it's not the cleanser because that cleanser is not brown. But oh my god, my skin, like, I'm really bad at this. Is, is this any different? Like, do I look different? Is my skin glowing? Is it glowing, y'all? I think I'm going to do my turmeric mask after this. Which, if you guys are interested in, I will post the link to that in the description box below. Just, dear guys, my skin it feels so nice. <gasps> Alright, so... Overall, sorry, overall, yeah, I like this. I like this Liz Oral Cleanse and Polish. It really is polishing. Like, my face is, like, soft as fuck right now. <laughs> Use my French, but, like, woo, I have never felt this, like, from a cleanser. Usually cleansers leave my skin especially because I have dry skin. leaves my skin kind of, like, dry and, you know, like, that taut, like, that squeaky clean feeling. The same squeaky clean that you want when you're washing dishes, but you may not want with your face because it's, it's very drying. And if you have oily skin, then yeah, maybe you want to use something like uh, this Rare Earth Deep Pore Cleanser by Kiehl's, which is also great. That was a birch box item. Or this uh, charcoal pore pudding from Boschia? Boschia? I don't know. B-O-S-C-I-A. How do I say that? Did I say it right? Let me know. So if any of you guys have tried these products or you want to see reviews for the other two, let me know in the, you know, the comment section below. You know the deal. You can message me or Instagram or tweet me. I don't know. Communicate with me. 
notes in some way. And I'll do it because I love these, honestly. I'm just, I'm so happy. I mean, I don't mean to make this video so long, but I love this. I honestly do. And I'm going to use my Aveeno moisturizer, even though my skin honestly didn't feel like it needed to be moisturized. I think that's why I'm so in love with this cleanser because the cleanser like left my skin feeling soft and, and I thought it looked more radiant. I don't know. You guys tell me. Anyway, I am not going to hold you guys forever. You know the drill. Like, comment, subscribe, all that. Or ignore me. Whatever. I don't know. But bottom line, thumbs up. I am happy with Liz Earl. Thank you, Birchbox, for sending me something I like, okay? Because they usually send me crap I don't want. Alright, bye curlies.